got a new show for y'all. Got a damn good show. All right, so Vivek is like um, galvanizing a bunch of uh, Republicans. Yeah, they right. still gonna vote for Trump, man. I'm just saying he's uh, he's on he's on uh, CNN's radar. Yeah, he uh, he's on a lot of people's radar because if Trump goes to jail, he might be the nominee. Trump ain't going to jail, man. You never know; they might plant some on him. You know how those Democrats roll? They cheat, lie, and steal. <laughs> <laughs> they gonna throw about two kilos in his limo one day. Say Trump is a drug dealer. Everybody's uh, gonna believe him. Nah, they, Trump they, is a kingpin of cocaine. Nah, they, nah, they're gonna do that. You know what they're gonna do? What? They're gonna get some AI, uh, put some, uh, they're gonna get some fuck tapes together. <laughs> <laughs> they're gonna have Trump banging a train. <laughs> I still think everybody's gonna vote for him. That's okay, Trump. I like trainings too. <laughs> <laughs> if you like him, I love him. <laughs> hey, but let's get serious on this. So, um, Vivek is on CNN's radar and, uh, Van Jones. I don't know how anybody takes this dude serious. Yeah. I only, huh? Listen to what he had to say about Vivek. Well, this is t- typical black dude. This is a typical black Democrat voter. Well, no, he's actually well-spoken. The typical black voter sounds like a moron. Well, well, that's true too. But he's the typical black. That's how the, the, the uh, typical mindset perspective, the typical mindset perspective. The yeah. typical black voter that can barely put a sentence together. But, you know, he's one of the black people that can actually speak and put, you know, I shouldn't have said that. All right, let's go to the video. I, I should take that back on. <laughs> that is dangerous. That's dangerous. And the smug, condescending way that he just spews this poison out yeah. is very, very dangerous because he won't stop Trump, but he's going to outlive Trump by about 50 years. <laughs> and you're watching the rise of an American demagogue that is a very, very despicable person. Yeah. And I, I'm, I literally, I, I, was, I was shaking listening to him talk because a lot of people don't know that is one step away from Nazi propaganda coming what? out of his mouth. He said he was shaking. <laughs> hey, Kev, this is shaking. He's like, this. <laughs> hey, you a damn fool. What's his name again? That's Van Jones. Damn Van Jones. You got a good white man's name, and you out here acting like some dumb... Don't say it. Yeah, that's a good name for a clothing line. A white man's clothing line. People buy it, too. Van Jones. What's the, what, cl- what white clothing lines you got? You got Dookie Gabbana. What's it called? Douche Gabbana? Douche? It's like you said, Douche Gabbana. <laughs> hey, whatever, Kevin. Whatever. But uh, Vivek hears about this, and this is what Vivek has to say about what he said. Vivek, man. We got to open our eyes to see that disease of dishonesty. The same government that has lied to us yep. about when not only what happened on 9-11, but the weapons of mass destruction in yep. Iraq, about the basis for the 2008 bailouts and the financial crisis, yep. about the Trump-Russia collusion hoax that never yep. was, about the Hunter Biden laptop story, which we absolutely yep. know to be true, about exactly what happened on January 6th yep. to the origin of COVID-19, to the Nashville transgender shooter man Manifesto yep. to how our own money is being spent in Ukraine today. Yep. We demand a government that tells us the truth again in this country. Yep. That's what we require. We can handle the truth. That's what it means to be a citizen of this country. <laughs> So I say that on that last debate stage to a bunch of Republicans that are shaking in their boots. These are the things you're not supposed to say in the Republican Party even today. And then you get the mainstream media. You got this character Van Jones on CNN afterwards saying, this is the rise of an American demagogue who's going to live 50 years longer than Trump. This is dangerous. I am shaking. That's what he says. (laughs) Just shut the fuck up. At a certain point, just shut the fuck up. (laughs) Van Jones at CNN. (laughs) Van Van Jones, you a damn fool, man. You a clown, man. You You a shaking dude. (laughs) Like a damn chihuahua. Why is it every time when 
Republicans express some opinions about something is dangerous. <laughs> Just a couple steps away from Hitler. <laughs> Stupid, man. Y'all some say slash just, just stupid. Man, what did Hitler do? Everybody knows, man. You ain't got to bring that, that up. That dude was trying to invade and take over the entire globe. Yeah, tried to He rounded up a bunch of Jews. I mean, this dude did cra- he horrible gonna, stuff. He was going to exterminate the Jews. He was, and, and you know who's next on this list? Us. Negroes. Because we just as bad. <laughs> It's probably worse. We should have been number one on the list. <laughs> man, shut, up. shut up, man. It's a joke. It's a horrible joke, but it's a joke. Yeah, it was I could say that. You know why? Because I'm black. <laughs> I didn't make up the rules Democrats did, so I'm just taking full <laughs> advantage of it. Black people can get away with murder. Oh, he's he's just a Negro. <laughs> he, look, look, he, don't, he, don't, he, he can't do much better. <laughs> He can't even find. He can't even go out and get a driver's license so he can vote somewhere. Cause can't he's use, a. Cause can't he's use a, a computer. Can't wear his pants right. <laughs> can't pay his bills on time. He's nothing but a Negro. <laughs> he can't help himself. Hey, um, yeah, man, I, love, I actually love Vivek, man. Yeah, I'm telling you, if Trump goes to jail, man. He's gonna be the next president. Man, and that dude's his hairline. Yeah, it's president. Like Trump's got a crazy hairline, he's got a crazy eye. Every time you come on, come across somebody with a crazy hairline, yeah. See, Biden ain't got a crazy hairline. He's got that crazy neck hair. <laughs> yeah. That when you get old, that neck hair, for some reason they don't fade it down. They let that neck hair just hang out. <laughs> I hate that about them old people walking with that. All that neck hair just hanging. <laughs> Trump's got a nice hairline though. No, his hangs down. Trump got that nice comb over. Yeah, but his hair in the back of his neck, it just hangs down. Who, Biden? But no, Trump. Trump's got a good back here. Trump, it just yeah. lays down. Biden, it's just like, yeah. looks like a Chucky doll <laughs> in the back. <laughs> looks horrible. Yeah, that, that F.A. Jones, man, you sensationalized, you misrepresented. Everything that came out of your mouth was an illogical fantasy. Yeah. You should be fired, but they won't because you're black. Hey, wh- what does he? What do he? What does Vivek have in common with Hitler? <laughs> yeah, he's brown. He doesn't Hitler even meet white. Yeah, he doesn't even meet the qualifications to be a Nazi. Yeah, Vivek he's did dark he skin. Did anybody? No, nope. yeah. Hitler did. He's dark skin, and look at his hairline. That is not white supremacy right there. <laughs> <laughs> That's Indian supremacy. <laughs> that was stupid. That was a damn good show, though. Damn good show. I think the white supremacists are gonna like that one. Hey, um, <laughs> we got a new giveaway going. Especially that... Shut up! That Jew F- joke. <laughs> <laughs> that F3, we get... <coughs> we get away... <coughs> we get away F350 and 10,000 in cash. The end of the way, and go to fishhorsetwins.com. Anything you buy on the site, you get you automatically. Hit up the win. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you being stupid, man? Yeah.